These two women have sparked statewide protests in India and drawn condemnation from the country's two main political parties, all with the simple act of walking into a Hindu temple. A centuries-old custom at the Sebramala Hill Temple in Kerala has blocked women of menstruating age, defined as between 10 and 50, from entering the religious site. India's top court ordered authorities last year to lift the ban, but the temple refused to comply and thousands of devotees have blocked women from gaining access. But following a two-hour middle-of-the-night trek and under police protection, the two women became the first ever to step inside on Wednesday. In the subsequent protests, police have used tear gas and water cannons to dispel large crowds who say the women defied a sacred Hindu tradition. But while Wednesday's incident was decried by some, it was hailed by gender equality activists. The entry of women in Sabramala today is a historic win for us. It's a victory of the movement of equality and it's a victory of female power. Kerala's left-wing state government defended its decision to protect the women entering the temple and backed thousands of female activists who formed a 385-mile-long human chain on Tuesday. It's a political position that has drawn strong opposition from India's two main parties, including Prime Minister Modi's BJP. The uproar has put religion squarely on the political agenda, months before a general election is due by May.